Good morning, friends. Brad Smith from The Way. I pray that you all had a blessed weekend in the name of the Lord. So this week at The Way, we are continuing our study through Ephesians chapter 6, the armor of God. We're going to talk about the breastplate of righteousness, the breastplate of righteousness this week. And we're going to come out of Ephesians and go to Romans chapter 3. And so Romans chapter 3 says in verse 21, But now the righteousness of God has been manifested apart from the law, although the law and the prophets bear witness to it. The righteousness of God through faith in Jesus Christ for all who believed, for there is no distinction, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God and are justified by His grace as a gift through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus whom God put forward as a propitiation by his blood to be received by faith. This was to show God's righteousness, because in his divine forbearance he had passed over former sins. It was to show his righteousness at the present time, so that he might be just and the justifier of the one who has faith in Jesus. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Uh, I'd like to pray for you this morning. Heavenly Father, I pray for the saints of the way and all the people, uh, Lord, that you would bless us this week. Lord, you are holy and righteous and just. You are merciful. Uh, you are the first and the last, the beginning and the end, the Alpha and the Omega. Lord, your word tells us that the mountains bow before you, the seas tremble before you. And so we acknowledge your lordship over all of reality, your lordship over all of creation, and your lordship over our lives. Lord, forgive us for our sins, cleanse us of all unrighteousness. Lord, I pray that you would bless us this week. I thank you for giving us another week. God, I thank you for the gift of life. I thank you for the gift of salvation, the gift of you, and the gift of time. God, that we've woken up this morning to draw more breath that we didn't deserve. And so I pray that you would bless this week. We offer ourselves up to you this week as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to you. Uh, God, we offer this week up to you. We offer the work of our hands up to you, uh, the words of our mouth. Lord, even the, the thoughts in our mind, we yield to you this week. And so God, just bless this week as a holy week. Protect us till we can assemble and gather again in your holy name. And we ask these things in the powerful and precious name of Jesus. Amen. Have a blessed week in the name of the Lord. Amen.